Vamos, 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 vamos. Dale, en go. Good. My name is Stephanie Alejandra Dominguez. Reached up and then back up. I am the athletic performance coach. I am in charge of the training load management. We use GPS. I have conversations with the coaches on how much we should do each day. Control it. Eso es bien. Good. We test performance uh, throughout the club, academy, second team, first team. So I'm in charge of, of that. And day to day, I just take care of like the warm ups and making sure that training loads are following protocol. Then we go into our push-ups when you're done with split squats. Besides that, I'm in charge of the strength and conditioning plan, so everything we do in the gym, and then obviously for games as well. It's a lot of communication with the coaches on what their, their plan is for the day, and then match my warm-up to that. Um, it's a little bit different throughout the different ages. After training, I do GPS, so I want to look at the data, how the team did, how each individual player did, their performance, did we hit the numbers, did we go over. I've played soccer since I was 12. And, um, I played college and then I played semi-pro here in the U.S. Uh, after that, I did my master's. I started here at FC Dallas as an intern with the youth, so I was in charge of like the summer camps. Um, then I left for a semester. I came back as an intern for the exercise science department with the first team. And then from there, I just stayed in that area. Look for mentors and look for opportunities to learn more every day, get involved. Internships are a huge deal. I think that helped me a lot, getting involved with the club. Jog to the blue cone and back. Jog it out. Working with the young athletes, you're trying to teach them um, body mechanics and how to move and how to run. So you want to be able to be a coach and a teacher at the same time. You learn a lot in school, but you're going to learn a lot more once you're hands-on. You were the first female performance coach in a male professional soccer league. Do you take any pride in that? And what do you think when you think about that? I never thought about it. And then when I found out, it, it was huge. It's huge for me. It's huge for my family. I think it's huge for the industry as well. It's something to be proud of because you're opening doors for others. And like I always said, it's important that I'm the first, but it's more important that I'm not the last. One of the things I want to do is inspire other, other women, other little girls, and hopefully one day someone can look up to me and not want to be like me, but know that they have the opportunity because I've, I've met a lot of women that they don't see the opportunity yet, and I want them to be able to see it. Touch with the right and go. Good. Always be prepared and never stop believing. Better, better, better. Eso.